So another part of business process flows you may not be familiar with is branched business process flows. So these allow you to travel down different paths in a process. So for example, this is a lead to opportunity business process flow, but it's a little bit different and it has three different conditions. So based on, in this case, what type of business the opportunity is, then the lead is qualified as a certain lead, whether that's one line of business or another. So as you can see, many of the components are very similar from one stage to the next, but uh, while very small, there are some numbers there that indicate there are a little bit of different steps required for each of these different business process flows. So that just goes to show that within a business process flow, the user might not even know it, but they could be traveling down a completely different path depending on what line of business they're working in.